Our students' tasks was to have the robot learn about objects and more specifically they actually used audio feedback and haptic feedback as a way for the robot to characterize 50 different objects with which it interacted repeatedly. This summer I worked with Dr. Alex Goychev's laboratory, developmental robotics laboratory, in which uh, we use multiple modalities to successfully recognize objects. We've been working on doing, on seeing if using multiple senses of perception is better than just one sense of perception when you're trying to recognize objects with a robot. We use both audio and proprioceptive information to attempt to classify 50 objects uh, to allow the robot to recognize which of the objects it was dealing with. So our contribution was basically add the sense of proprioception and see if we can improve the recognition rates by using multiple modalities. We trained it on 49 of the objects and then tested it on the 50th. So obviously it can't get the 50th one right because it's never used it before. So we just look to see what it thinks it is. What's deceptive about it? Like it has the <laughs> thing in it to keep it cold. So it feels it's heavier than it looks. I worked on coding the uh, specifically for the robot itself, writing the code to interact with the hardware. Uh, and I also wrote code to do uh, feature extraction, like a self-organizing map. I worked on a lot of the more uh, abstract theoretical stuff, I guess. My role in the project was to see, was to use some C program to record these trajectories for the robots to interact with these objects. I got to go to a conference in Seattle, a robotics conference, um, with my mentor and some of the other grad students in the robotics lab that I was working in. A good highlight from the summer is we went paintballing. That was a lot of fun. Had a few bruises. The audio in general was really fun. Um, I got a great idea of what I was going to be, what research was like and our results are actually really good, so we're thinking of submitting to some conferences and workshops in the next few weeks.